What's up, you guys? It is Mary. And Ama. We invite you guys to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Down below, because today we are going to be talking about this, was it? Sense the sins of, of Robin, Robin that has broken down and obliterated the Brown family. Yes. This video is a long time coming. It is. And I'm so happy that we're finally doing it. The too. first thing I is the major one, and that is greed. Greed, absolutely. The sin of greed. Just being greedy. Just getting you had just your trying five to get year more. plan, which was fine. I'm gonna find a husband for myself. But more importantly, I'm gonna because she said she didn't care about that. She really cared about the father for the children. Yes. So you found a father for the children, somebody who you called who will take care of the kids. You found a provider. You found a provider because that's what you needed. You wanted. You found a protector. Someone protected who, your family. Yeah, and someone who was going to be there for the children because you saw yes. how he was present. Yes. For his children. Thank you, oh, Dada. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. So you saw that he was present for his children, and you wanted that. So you got that right you were able to start your business so because you wanted to have something in your name which was great you started the sister wife stuff yes i had no problem with that okay yes you were able to get a place yes of your own a house of your own you got your debt cleared your we never talked about that your she debt, had a debt was cleared. cleared by the family fund oh yes okay that is Janelle Sweat Blood Tears. And Father's Inheritance that we found out on our life. <laughs> okay. 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 Let's just sit on that. Let's just take a breath. Ooh, take a child. breath. So that occurred. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, you hurried up, dumped that husband real quick, mm -hmm. the one you had, okay, he wasn't cutting it in the money thing, I gotta go find somebody else before my looks begin to fail me, I ain't got nothing wrong with that, I thought that was smart, okay, you don't have to put the man down though, so now this is where we come to bearing false witness. Well, also, let's talk about how she So the lied. greedy, okay, so let's finish with the greedy, let's finish with the greedy, sorry, Let, let's finish with the greedy, right? So now you got that stuff. I'm fine with that. Children secure. You have something for yourself. So if yes. your marriage is over, at least you got a, a house in your name. Yes. All right. You did. You did not. The debt clear. That was a bonus. A surprising yeah. icing to the cake. Well, I'm sure right? she was. I'm sure that was on her five year plan. Have her debt cleared by this man who's going to clear right. it for her. Right. And have well, those three well, hardworking because... wives do it as well. I'm sure that was on her list. Because okay. why would you want to keep debt? To... Yeah, but but I think I think even even her owning a house. I don't even think she well, was yeah, on five year but that, plan. But 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 certainly getting her business. Yes. I think that was on the plan. I want a, a, a business for myself. So if anything happens, because I'm in a plural marriage, I'm no longer with this person. I have something of my own. I, have an I didn't asset. come with nothing. I have an asset, right? Yes. Okay, that's great. But then you got greedy. The greediness starts now you want the children to be adopted. Well, the kids being adopted, which was I really feel like the kids can be adopted without you marrying the children. I, I, I feel like if someone signs off their child, like the husband was gonna sign off the children anyway, the previous father, he could have adopted the child. Yeah. He could adopt to them. You didn't need to get Mary, make Mary no longer the wife. Yeah. That's when the greediness starts. Yeah. Because now you want more. I want to go from fourth wife to first wife. Crazy. And I want to be the only legal wife. I want him to skip Janelle, Christine, and come to me. And so now that you're the legal wife, I have the say-so in the family's finances. finances. Which really should be Janelle, okay. but she's been Whereas doing it. Whereas Janelle before, Janelle said that all this time she's been the one who does all the family stuff. And all that. She said things started to change a few years back. Robin which, came. which probably Robin's like, we don't need Janelle to do this. Uh, we can find somebody else to do it for us. 
Yeah. But still, Janelle is the one who got a ticket to go give it to the person. So that's how she still gets stays in the know. But things were changing. Janelle was seeing that. Robin trying to put her stamp on it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right there, it shows that you want to get the wives out of it. Even though this tilly that you have right here does not belong to you. Yeah. Your sister wives ain't making that much. Do not miss me with that nonsense. How L sister listen, wives pay for anything. The Walmart, I doubt it. The, okay? It looks like Walmart jewelry that they are charging $200 yeah. for some cheap wave looking necklace. Yeah. Like, it's Danielle's blood, horrible. sweat, and tears. Yes. That has filled up that, that house. The Mary also works. You know, it, it has nothing to do with you, Robin. But you wanted it, though. Then you get greedy. I need to have the bigger plot. Remember how Cody was having a fit? How they had given, uh, given uh, Mary wants to give Robin scraps. Remember he had this whole yes, thing? Yes, I did. How Mary wants to give Robin scraps. You would never, let, and, and, you would and, never and, allow and, it to happen, and Cody. She, she has the whatever and this and that. Remember, and at that time, Christine you know, was there trying to be kissing Robin's behind. Anyway, but so that's the greed. Yeah. Okay. He was feeling cotton wood, which is what Mary and Christine like. I mean, Janelle also like cotton wood. All of a sudden, now they want Coyote Place, right? Because that's what Robin liked. Yeah. So now you start putting your foot on their necks. No, they're not gonna have the land that Christine likes. I I like this one better. So then he changes his mind, and you know he will. So now you start the manipulate. So that's where the greed comes in, okay? 1222. I, I know. Wow. We are seeing like these numbers. This is so crazy. Really, our numbers are like 11, 11, and 22, yeah. 22. And it's just showing. So that's greed. That's gluttony. Oh. Okay? Yeah. With those two things, it always leads to slothfulness. Yes. Which is another sin. Yes. Lazy. Yes. You came in here. You were too lazy to assimilate with a family. Yeah. You were too lazy to, be a good to mom. go help Christine with the mothering and nurturing. You're too lazy to have sister wife relationship. Laziness. You're also too lazy to raise your own children. <laughs> Hello. Because Brianna, I remember she Speak always Arnett. calling Aurora to help her with kids and, and stuff like that. Laziness. Slothfulness. Okay? Envy. Robin, very envious. This whole thing that Cody's always talking about someone being jealous. Cody, you and Robin are jealous people. Cody, you're jealous of Christine. Some men are jealous of their wives. Absolutely. Cody was jealous of Christine. Robin, jealous of Christine. Yeah. Also jealous of Janelle. Yeah, of course. Because Janelle had Cody's ear for finances and the workings of, of you know, how they're going to do, you know, of their nest. Okay? Christine had his ear about what's going on, the inner workings of the family. Yes. You are jealous of that. No, Very funny. jealous you never of talk that. about but how anybody's ever jealous of Mary. I guess there's nothing to be jealous <laughs> Well, she certainly was jealous of her legal wife document. Oh, at least we gave you a little crumb, Mary. But she knew that she could get that easily. That's why she tried she, you. Mary is like a lap dog. Pat I mean, me, pat me, I'll do whatever you say. What was the other one? <laughs> no loyalty to the family. None. That you admired from afar, yet envied. Because you realize that the way the family dynamics were, was in a large part due to Janelle working as working like a workhorse, soldiering out there, her inheritance, and then uh, Christine working the home. Yeah. So she already, you know, came in with that. So she had no, so even though you, you saw that, you weren't loyal to it. No. You weren't loyal to it, and you couldn't be loyal to it because of the envy. See, these are, it ties in. Yeah. One sin allows other sins to manifest. Yeah. When you stay in that sin long enough, 
it starts manifesting. Yeah. And it becomes something else. What was the other one? You were a thief. Yes. You stole a woman's husband, committed yes. adultery, but you were there kissing a married man. You were not married to him. Nope. I don't care if you were engaged to him. You were not married to him. That man is married and has wives. Yeah. Even though you were engaged, you guys could have broken up. Yeah. You could have broken up and that would have been it. It would have been over. Yeah. Okay? There's no commitment there. So, adultery. Adultery. He was there having an affair and enjoying it. Yes. Enjoying it. And the thing is, you were spending and so remember, much extra time with her yeah. that was so unnecessary. Yes, And you'll be driving like five, six hours, several times a week to like go see ridiculous. her. And then you had her in a whole house. Yes. Before they By were herself. even married. Yeah. Had her in a whole house. Yes. Moved her. Yes. Told all the wives to go yeah. be there. And you then you something? also had your you daughter. You could have moved Mary a little bit and she could have shared Mary's. You Area. made your whole family assimilate to Robin. Yes. Everybody had to make changes for this new one. Which yes. really, she should be breaking her back to come into this exactly. family. Exactly. And you should have seen to that. Even had McKelty over didn't. there babysitting exactly. the kids and all this Where stuff. Where McKelty could so have been over could here be helping going... Christine with the 18 children. Yes. But, but you, you have her, her helping her with her three kids? Yeah. What? Yeah, it was only three kids at that time. Exactly. Okay. It was craziness. Craziness. You were prideful. Yes. Because a woman who's like that, you have this pride that, yes, it has to be done differently for me. I am deserving of having everyone kowtow to me. It's like, remember when Prideful. we got our cats? Remember when we got donuts? We had donut, right? Yes. And then we had Gray, who freckles. was a stray. No, Freckles. Oh, yeah, yeah. We Gray had Gray, who was a stray. And we could say that about Miko and, and Freckles. Exactly. Yes. We had these two cats in America or whatever. Yes. It was a cat that I was feeding from outside. I brought him in one day. Yes. And you told me, no, mm -hmm. do not put Donut away in the room. Yes. Gray is the newcomer. Yes. She has to assimilate to, to Donut's donuts. house because yes. this is her domain. Exactly. And when I started doing that, yes. Donut calmed down. Because at first, down. Donut was fighting her. She hated and her. And Gray became very prideful. Yes. Almost like, yes, I'm the one. Even the way she was strutting herself around the house. <laughs> like, it's my thing. And, and then as soon as Donut comes and wants to go hiss at her, she she wants to. And then you go, Donut, you grab Gray. And, eh. I said, no, that one is becoming. She wants to take the queen over this whole thing. Yes. No, you take your tail. You and be you in the go room. be in the crate. You be in the room. Oh, you this be in the crate. This is Donut's house. Yes. Yeah. Donut got to get used to you. And yes. when she's calm and she's happy around you in your crate, then we'll bring you out. Yes. Because this is her home, not yours. Yes. Okay. You're new here. But I because remember. Cody... Yeah. Did you, have, you have to do it with cats. Can you imagine human beings? So he was putting her over there. Wants everyone to kowtow to her. Christine wanted her to come help out. Because she was happy. Hey, you can come now and help. No, no. She's going to stay over there. My Kelta has to go to her. And you allow that, Cody. Now she became prideful. Yeah. She became prideful. Now, she's so prideful, she got the nerve to ask Janelle, when, when did your children Ever feel, feel like she, they are not welcome? Yeah, uh, Christine, you're lying. You're lying. That's a lie because I remember the time when we were all here and, and you cannot tell me mm, that mm, you were not happy and we were all having a good relation. Mary, why did you call her and say, Robbie, you're lying? I never had a good relation with Cody. <laughs> But you sat there like a lap dog. And then like you lied on Christina said that Who you said that? I had I was only with a functioning relationship. She but you know that's true though. You know that's witness. true. Robin is a bearer of false witness. She is a liar. Isn't that in the Quran? I mean it's in all the religious books about the lying. She is a liar. No she bearing is false a witness. It's in the Bible. Is it in the Quran? Too? It's also there. Okay. I was like, I know I heard yeah. that from my She religion. is a liar. Okay? And that's why I don't believe her when she said they text her and called her, blaming her for the family. They were calling you out on stuff. Yeah. They're trying to pull your coat They tails, probably didn't say how you were saying Because you it. have the sin of pride, you can't accept it. You can't take any accountability. This is the pride. Yeah, buddy. This is the narcissism. 
Okay, it starts with pride. Yeah. No, how dare these children who you try to lie again and say that, oh, they're like my children and I love them. You're a liar. A liar, liar. Because you don't treat them <laughs> like your children. You lie and say, I love this family. I love this family. I always wanted to be part of this family. But when you married into the family, you put yourself apart. And all of the wives can attest to that. Yes. Except to a Mary who also bears false witness at times. Yeah. She will lie on Cody's behalf at the drop of a dime. Yeah. You think because you lie, he's going to love you? It has not worked for you up until today. <laughs> you better okay. preach this So what did we say? We did the adultery. We did pride. We did greed with, and gluttony loyalty together. And we did loyalty. We did slothfulness. Did we do loyalty? Okay. We did loyalty. We did, um, she has no compassion. That's the sixth thing. No compassion. Zero she, compassion. She, oh my God, Mary and Cody were in a horrible place in their marriage. No. And you took advantage of that yeah. to get her to get him to divorce, to get the last him thing to that divorce she had her. To the, the, the tied her with Cody. You ripped it from her. No compassion. Zero loyalty to the family. This is how you met the family. You met the family. Mary was the legal wife. The family that you say you loved. No loyalty to that. No compassion to that. Like a gangster you went through and shut it all up. Shut it all up. Ooh. Yes. <laughs> Drive by. And we're just like, no. Even that that you're holding on to with your fingernail, you don't get to keep. Give it to me. It's mine. Yes. Gluttony. And even as Christine is suffering. Yes. No compassion. None. She's leaving the family. Leaving the family. And you call her a liar. Yes. You're a liar. You had a functioning relationship. Yes. Because I know, because Cody was telling me his side. Mm -hmm. And, and then, even Janelle, even when, when she's talking about her sons, you're sitting down here saying that you're and a liar. Exactly. Pretty much. They That's have always right. felt welcome. Exactly. How would you know? How would you know? And you know they don't feel welcome because Cody goes and tells you all the business. So you he just tells lying. you all the business. <laughs> Why no are they compassion. not felt welcome? No compassion. Even when Chrissy was she crying, if she stood over there with her children and she, looked and, up and, and, like and, and and showed the children how to have zero compassion. The girls were you could see the tears in their eyes. They really did want to go. Yeah. You could tell they wanted to go. But Cody, like a jackass. No, only me. only me, only me, only me. But when Christine was crying, you could tell they were breaking down as they saw Christine crying. They might have been feeling a little and, like no, and, and she of their stood mother. There. Yeah, that with her boxy ass chin, there, prideful, no compassion. That Did not wrong. even go to the sister. Just stood there like, hey, with her no, with her head all up, with her boxy ass chin. Yes, yes, yes. And that's what you heard. That's what you're showing your children. And one day they're gonna to turn to you and they'll have no compassion for you. We're waiting Ooh. for that. We're waiting. Let's just rest because the daughter is gonna be like the mom. Take a breath. Okay. So with all of this, are you trustworthy? You can't be. No. You cannot be someone who's trustworthy. You're non-trustworthy. I cannot trust you. They cannot trust you. No. No, no, and that's the seventh sin. These women cannot even trust you with their husbands. Yeah, they can't trust you with their children. You have the ear of Cody. You will not even speak to him for him to do right by his children. Yeah, you don't love those kids. Look how upset you were when Hunter was holding. Um, truly, yeah. You wanted to make sure Hunter holds Solomon. You, Hunter loves children. But you were envious of that. And you the only reason why like Hunter was holding truly was because he saw how... Cody's not even holding uh, truly. truly. How, how Cody was so... What's the word? Uh, he was all over the child. What's the word? He had like this favoritism for Solomon. And he saw that. And he saw that they're both babies. Yeah. So he'll go there and hold truly. He will try to fill up that spot because that's what Hunter does. Yeah. 
He's a protector in the true sense of the word. Yeah. The other thing you don't do, you don't listen. You don't listen well at all. Her and Cody. Yeah, they you should do a sense of Cody eight. as well. They're, they're both in there. Yeah. You know? But, oh, yeah, I have more for him, I'm sure. Absolutely. You know, you don't, as a sister, you do not protect. You didn't care for these children. No. These kids had a life. They had a family that you say you want your children to be a part of, which I do believe in the beginning she did want her kids to be a part of that. But your jealousy of Christine, your jealousy of the nurturer that got the kids like that, yeah. Well, was what held you back and your pride was what held you back from being humble enough to go figure out how to really become a true nurturer. So yeah. you missed the boat on that. Okay? You're not supportive. And that can be with the protecting and caring. You don't protect. You don't care for. You're not supportive of these kids, of these women. You don't look out for them. You know the other thing? She and Cody, they hold on to stuff. You're unforgiving. But yet, you want to talk about how you pray to God. Yeah. No Last I check, God, very forgiving. Yeah. You guys are very unforgiving. It goes with the prideful. Yeah. I think that's sin number 10. You're not dependable. They can't depend on you people. They can't. They can't depend on Robin no. to do anything. They can't Nothing. even um, depend on you to actually just be a decent human being. To even do right by them in terms of the money. No. By now, you guys should have paid for that land. Yeah, all they're of, in all a of ten Mary. bedroom mansion. What do you need that for? I don't know. All Mary's money for the sale of her house went to Robin. Went to you and half of the sale of Janelle's house. You by yourself needed one and a half. But you guys can all go pay for the land so that Janelle can build and Mary can build because they don't they didn't buy a house. So you know it's, it goes back. No no thought for the sisterhood. No. You don't want for your sister what you want for that yourself. Goes back to you being want green. for yourself what you want for yourself. Yeah. And the sister should have nothing. Yeah. Should have nothing. You own a house. It's in your name and Cody's name. You have an asset. Janelle has nothing. And you want to keep it that way. Yeah. And um, you do, what we're talking about, she just tells her, she doesn't keep, oh, gossiping. Yes. Gossiping about the family. Gossiping. Gossiping about the kids. Making contentious relationships with Cody and, yes. his, and, his, and, his, and his kids. Yes. Through your gossiping. And through your lying. Through your go and, through and your the lying. lying. Gossiping, gossiping, gossiping. You guys stay gossiping. gossiping about the family. Christine is not there. You guys have a Christine bashing fest. All the time. To the point that Janelle has to walk off. <laughs> to the point that she hates family discussions. Yes. She can't deal with this anymore. I know. I think those are 12 sins. Yeah. I think those are 12. You guys who have been counting. Like, yeah. this is since of Robin. And it's because really of all of that, it has been like a domino effect, one after the other. And yeah. you have just totally obliterated this family yeah. to smithereens. They're not recognizable since you came in like a damn mammoth yeah. and just trumped all over them. Yeah. Like some gangster with an AK-47 uh, or 57, I don't even know what they call it. What do you call it? AK or AR? I don't know. You all who know your guns, you well, know what it is. This is not a channel where we know about guns. We don't condone violence. Well, no, what I'm saying, some people know about guns. I mean, you know, guns are not just for violence, just guns, you know. But, anywho, those who know about the guns, I don't. I don't know if it's is it AK-47 or AK-57 or is it AR-57? I don't know. I have no idea. Or is no it ARP? Oh, no, that's for old people. Anyway, I don't know. <laughs> you guys tell us. But she took some kind of gun. And what gun did she use to blow this family up? Her lies, her deceits, oh her sins, her gossip, all of that. Pain, her lying. All of that. All the sins we have listed, she used that as a weapon to obliterate this yeah. family. 
And if you guys know any other sin, manipulation, manipulative tactics, being yes. deceitful, yes. that all goes with deceit. Try to be a victim all oh, the yes. time. Stay trying to be a victim. Yeah, that's the pride too. Yeah. You think every your problem is bigger than anybody else's. But you want your everybody to validate matters. your else feelings, problems but matters. you don't want to validate yes. anybody else's feelings. Yes, because you're worthy to be validated, and they're not. Yeah, because they've been mean to you, you say, quote-unquote. But we know you are a liar. Yes, straight up a liar. So, so you guys, get but in yes, the comments. comment down below. Do Let you guys know. know more sins? What are the other sins of yes. love that has obliterated this family? Yes. Let us know. And what do you think about the sins that we have called so far? Yes, you guys. And thank you so much. much for watching. But it is Mary. And Alma. Um, uh, Please watch this a like. Subscribe. Share. And comment. Down below. Bye.